Well, morning. It's uh, Friday, 31st of uh, October, and I'm very quite excited because I've got in front of me a sample of a revolutionary type of plant pot. And as you can see, it is very different. Okay, now this is called the Air Pot and it's from a company called the Caledonian Tree Company up in Scotland and I've just been sent these two samples not half an hour ago so this is hot off the press so how do they work well it's basically what they refer to as air pruning now when a plant is inside a, a, a pot like this and it reaches one of these holes it reaches a level where the oxygen is an excessive level for the root and the root basically stops growing. It sends a message back to the, the tree or the main root and says send more roots. And basically what happens, the plant prunes itself and it stops roots growing as in a conventional pot, the root will just continue to grow and it'll just go around and around like that and get root bound. So you've got few roots going around kind of in circles and when you take it out of the pot you've got this great big long root and nothing much else. Now with the air pot system, this is how I understand it, so you know, I, somebody could quote me as being not quite right. As I understand it, what happens when you put your tree or your plant inside, then the, the roots keep going out because as they come to the air holes, they stop growing and the, uh, the, the tree or the plant then starts sending a signal for uh, another root to be sent to grow out because this one stopped growing which doesn't work in the conventional pot um, and I first saw these and I researched it over many months um, uh, Jeff Lawton referring to these on a project he was on in Hong Kong I believe where a, a valley had been totally uh, revitalized and they had a nursery with thousands of these pots now I don't know if it's an Australian system but these guys, this uh, Caledonian Tree Company, have been around since about 1990, but we haven't heard of it. Anyway, it's here in Cyprus. And so I, uh, I wrote to them some time ago and asked them for a couple of samples. Eventually, we got it sorted. So this is a three litre sample. I'll just give you a good close look at that. And you can see, I know it looks a little bit strange from the outside. And that is the bottom. Now, basically, when your plant's ready to, uh, your, your tree, whatever it is, ready to plant out, it is so cool because there's a little key here. There's one. This is a three litre, okay, and the one over here is a seven litre. So all you do, you unscrew this chap, ta-da, and then you simply open the pot and it reveals the plant and all the roots so it, you can just put it on its side open it and your plant is complete you don't have to try and loosen it from the plant pot it will come out and this is the removable bottom they, they do this because they what they do they send them out uh, flat packed but because I've just had two samples sent they sent them like this now the thing about this plastic is these are made from recycled plastic so and these will last because it's actually it, it's pretty tough I don't think you could tear or you know damage it because a lot of pl uh, conventional plastic plant pots don't seem to last but if you've got a few of these doing the job uh, I think they'll last you quite some years so that's the three litre uh, three litre one and simply you just put one hole in there like that I've only done this once before but it seems to just go back together and you put it somewhere near the top you just and as you can see it's got a small spiral on it and this just goes into one of the holes and connects the two holes and keeps them keeps them uh, together well of course I forgot to put this in the bottom and that didn't quite match up so that's the three litre one now this is the seven litre seven litres of uh, compost I guess you would put in it with a, a convex bottom very nice again fairly tough recycled plastic so this is the other one you can see and this this one um, as you can see has two two pegs 
Okay, so I'm going to post this on the Permaculture in Cyprus uh, post. I don't have prices yet, um, uh, but I should have all information by the uh, we come to the uh, fun day on the 15th of November uh, at the um, Atsas Farm Education Centre. So watch out for this. And um, I'm actually going to put uh, a plant, I'm going to put a tree in here now, and we'll see when we'll open it for the first time live at the fun day to see what the root system looks like. So you can then decide for yourself and by then I should have prices. So thanks for watching and um, see you soon.